Yo, what's happening? So, I haven't done a uh, voice note in a while and thought it's about time. So, recently there's this really, I laughed at it, funny tweet that went viral. And it's a chick and she says, this is what my dad told me. Honey, it's impossible for you to ever find a man who is more intelligent than you. Because, you know, she's like, she's, she's so smart. Um, the least thing you can do is find a man who's at least richer than you, has more money than you, okay? Now, that got a varying range of responses, but, um, and there's a couple points I want to make here. Number one, you can't get mad at a girl for wanting more, okay? The most central thing that all female attraction stems from is your superiority. You as a man, okay? Every single girl on the planet that is healthy mentally... Once a guy who's smarter than her, richer than her, funnier than her, taller than her, bigger than her, stronger than her, more charismatic than her, more witty than her, like, it's just, duh, what kind of woman would want to marry down and, like, downgrade, right? We marry women because they're beautiful in their hearts and in their souls and they'll raise our children. She wants a man who can take care of shit, who's got it all under control, where she can relax. She can worry about her thing you can, and you, leave you to worry about everything else, Right? That's how it works. So, guys, you aren't allowed to get mad at that. Yeah, she's been a bit, you know, cocky in the, in the, in the quotation. Who cares? I do that as well. But, um, you know, you can't get mad at girls for wanting more and, and aspiring to that. It's normal. It's fine, okay? But the second part of this, I wanted to share with you a study that's actually insane, okay? It's not my opinion. It's a genuine I forget, I think it was some British university study. They found that, so uh, I'm going to explain for people who don't know what IQ very well. Okay, IQ as a number, we've established, we've made it, right? because we set the numbers. We've set that 100 is the average. It's dead middle. Um, in countries like Australia, UK, USA, the average IQ is 99 in countries like Singapore, Malaysia, like Japan, it's like 104, 105. It's like that, okay? But most people are at 100. And every single point you get up higher, it's, it's a massive difference, okay? So this study found that for women, every 16 IQ points that you have higher than 100, so for example, 116, 132, right? For every 16 points increase, women are 40% less likely to get married because they can't find someone smarter than them. Like, that, that's the, the, the general thesis behind this point. But for men, it's different. For men, for every 16 points increased in IQ, their likelihood of getting married increases by 35%. So, you know, that leads people like me with an IQ of 200. I mean, it's, just, it's a guarantee at that point. But, uh, yeah, just thought it'd be interesting. And I just wanted to correct it. I, left, I see a few guys getting mad. Like, oh, women want better. Like, bro, would you not want, if you were a chick, the biggest bowler you could find, the smartest guy, the most funny, etc. Like, everything. Why wouldn't you? Just let them do it. They're girls. They're allowed.